Hey, this is Cameron from the Sea Butters channel, and today we're going to take a look at the Microsoft Surface Pro 3. Direct from Microsoft. This is the box that you'll get if you order it from the Microsoft Store. Launch day. And let's check it out here. Microsoft Surface Pro 3. So it's an interesting box here. Tape on one side. And there it comes out like that. And nicely wrapped. Have the Service Pro 3. Underneath you have manuals, <clears throat> user guide, a AAA. Oh, quadruple A battery. Have you ever seen that before, anyone? I have never seen a quadruple A battery. Here's the stylus. Very nice, nice weight. Top screws off. Oh. Tells you which way the battery goes in. It's nice. We'll throw that in there. Get us going. I wonder if that comes. Do I leave that on? I guess that doesn't matter. Battery installed. We'll play with that in a minute once we get it going. Um, I'm assuming, yep, over on this side we've got the AC adapter. Which I hear is pretty cool, pretty small. There you go right there. Windows 8 Professional. And it has the USB charging port on the back here for your auxiliary devices, which is pretty nice. And flat cable. This is a rounded cable on the other end. Magnetic. So that is the AC adapter. And let's take a look at the Pro 3 itself. Ever since I saw the video from Microsoft on this device, I was pretty stoked. The only thing that was holding me back from an original Surface device is the fact that it had um, just a 10 inch screen. So when I heard about this device and saw the uh, video, I got pretty excited. Even though I had a ThinkPad Yoga, I decided I'd go for this one. So I won't bore you with my personal details. Um, so you've got lots of different capabilities. This is the power charging port. This is a mini display port. Got a, your one USB port. Button on the front camera, camera, on the other side, volume, headphone jack, and of course the flip hinge, which opens to one level and then adjustable to any other level, which was the other thing that got me really stoked, the fact that you could bend it down to this level, do some drawing, do some writing, um, really makes the Surface 3 more usable for me versus the original Surface. I couldn't get into the original Surface, but I'm really excited to try this thing out. Um, and of course, uh, we've got our type cover. So do you see that magnetic pop in? It's pretty sweet. So there we have it. 
touch keyboard pops up to the top to gain that leverage and that actually feels pretty nice so let's take a look at that type keyboard shut and the surface shut pretty flat surface embossing and on the back all in all it looks pretty nice I'm pretty excited we'll uh, have some more videos up on uh, this device very soon thanks for watching